Hey Divas and Gents, I'm coming to you with my downtown LA haul of beads. So let me go ahead and dive on in. It's not a super huge haul, but enough to share. So um, I only went to two stores and it's kind of like the two stores I'm always going to. And this one, and they are both on Maple. So anybody who goes to, come on, um, downtown LA, and it's not going to show really. The writing's really light and dim. Oh, gosh, there we go. It's Gold Star Fashion Jewelry. And there's the address. Now, this is right across the street from Bead Factory, which is the one I go to all the time. And that is that. So that's the one I go to. And then, and it's, the camera's not picking up because the font on this is smaller and the ink on it is lighter. And this is right across the street from here. Right across the street. Okay, so the first one. They have, this is where I got the compacts from previously that I did. They have new compacts that are absolutely adorable. So this whole face part slides up. Isn't that the cutest? Oh my gosh. So adorable. Oh my goodness. So cute. So I love it because you can add charms. And then I got this really cute one where the whole heart moves up and it's a compact. So I'll be adding some dangles to these and of course gifting them. I thought those were uber. And <clears throat> I didn't go crazy in this one. This is the one I normally buy a lot of these kind of beads. But um, I didn't. So I only got this blue set. And it's cracked. It's the crackle bead. And these are all glass. So I just got this really pretty blue one. And I absolutely love, love very, very much these um, stones. Let me try to open it out of the bag. Um, natural stones are my number one favorite. <clears throat> and these right here are my to die fors. I could not resist when I seen this. It's $5 for this one piece, but um, I love it. This will be just a pendant on a necklace. So you don't add anything but chain because this right here is your statement piece and it's absolutely insane gorgeous. I love it. I love stuff like this. So I had to pick that up for myself. Then I picked up these bags of cabochons. They're like um, a medium size and this is like a denim blue. So pretty. And these bags right here were $2 each. This store does not have an online. I know somebody probably asked me. There is no online store for this one. So if you don't live in California and can't get to downtown LA, unfortunately, you can't get these. And I got these two, and they're in two different shades. And there's 200 pieces. And this was such a good deal. I wish they had more colors. I would have got all of them because two bucks for these bags a sweet deal. And these cute little daisies are adorbs. Two bucks each. And that was it. That's all I got from that store. Alright, now this is um, Bead Factory. The Bead Factory. This one does have an online store, um, but they do not carry every single thing as if you were to go inside the store. So, just so you know, you can... Um, go to thebeadfactory.com and you can order online and all that stuff, but they just don't have as much. Okay. So I've been on the skull kick. So, and they have colored skulls. So I got yellow, of course my fave. And then I got this really pretty light pink and I'm going to go ahead and, um, bedazzle the eyeballs. So that's why I got these ones. And these ones are kind of smaller. So I love it because it's only a dollar fifty, and you get um, a lot of these um, skulls. You, um, it's two times more, and you only get half when you go to Michaels. So, like for instance, this is a bracelet I made, a stack bracelet, and I wanted to mix some different colors, so I used pink and blues. 
and I had a blast putting this together and I put my little skulls on there with the pretty gems in the eyes I use this really pretty dangle piece oh, yeah, these ones that no I made those ones okay and then see so I added more skulls it's really pretty charm So I love the skulls with the blings on them. I absolutely love them. I think they're so stinking cute. I know a lot of you are not fans of it and that's okay. I've been digging it. It's my thing at this point in time. And I did pick up these right here. These are also all crackle beads and um, glass. And these right here are absolutely, anytime I can find something yellow, I get it. Yellow is just not an easy color to find in the bead world. And then these are all the other glass ones that I picked up. Some of them are duplicates because these are colors I actually really need. So I made sure to pick up on these. This is like a pink milk glass. They used to have more milk glass options and colors, but they don't anymore, which is a bummer. So I got the white, the pink, and the baby blue milk glass in two different sizes in the milk glass. I picked up two strands of the yellow with the iridescent to it. I picked up this cloudy clear. And then, of course, I picked up, you know, two of the milks in this one and two in the other one. So these are um, just things that I needed. So it's super gorge. And of course, it looks all yummy put together. Okay, and then... For the ones that are not like a circle strand, they're just one strand. These are what I picked up. So I picked up this blue one. I have this blue, but I think it's bigger. So I want to do my wire wrap rings. I like using these. They look so pretty. Okay. This right here is a really pretty light yellow. And it's just a really pretty, um, I don't want this to fall. Gorgeous on both sides. Here is just a clear heart. And right here. And this right here, these hearts are really pretty. It's like a charcoal gray black platinum type color. I need to build more on my black and grays. So gorgeous. I do have this color, but in the larger size. And this is the smaller. It's um it's like a I don't know, peacock mermaid color. It's really gorgeous. And the heart is sideways, so I really dig that. This right here is also, um, it's a light gray. And then I loved this yellow, and it has like hints of green in it. Super pretty. So these are all the one single strands that I picked up. Okay, so for my little skulls, I did pick up these um, these flat backs, and this one right here is so gorgeous. It's got like, oh my gosh, I don't know. I can't even explain the colors that's in it. It's like a multi-mix color. Oh, it's so gorgeous. And then, of course, I have this pink color, which is like a pink-blue color. It's like pink-blue-purple. It's insane beautiful. And this one right here is like an orange. It like picks up on whatever color you're going to, you know. It picks up on green, yellow. It's just gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I love these. So I picked up a couple of those. Um, I picked up sequin. And this one right here is a really pretty light blue, almost a periwinkle color, purplish blue. This right here is just a transparent, really pretty pink. And then these right here. These are the smaller ones. I don't have very many, <coughs> excuse me, small sequins. Now you'll see it says Bohemian 
on here. Crystal, because that was the original name. I've been going here for many, many, oh my gosh, just under 20 years. And um, they were originally Bohemian. It, so I guess they just did their name change, but all of their cards, it's the same people that own it. So they just changed it. So you'll see it says Bead Factory and then it says Bohemian Crystal. So it's always been that way. So don't I, don't, I don't want you to think that these are different because you see a different name right here. They're all from the same spot. Anywho, on to the next. And then I got these. These are um, acrylic bows. And um, these have the holes that go right through the top and to the bottom. So you can hang dangles this way. So I got them in this three colors. It's really pretty green and the mustard yellow. Love it. And then this one right here. Okay, so those are the three colors and those that I got. Then I just picked up these. These right here are just like a plastic bead and a silver and a gold. I like uh, mixing these in my stretchy bracelets. So these are super cute. Then I picked up these. These are hearts. They're just little flat. Um, They're really pretty. They look crystally, and they look like they have more little diamonds on top. But it's just the cut of the bead that makes it look like that. Let's see, that are gorgeous. And it's really pretty pink. So this one right here is a really beautiful green color. So I got those three. Then I got something new. They had some new stuff there. So. These right here, let me show you because um, these I'm going to make stretchy bracelets out of. Hobby Lobby has a couple options that are like this. And, um, come on camera. And these ones right here are two like this. So I can string this on a stretchy string and put on my beads. And that's what I'm going to use these for. They're so pretty. So I got these ones in a silver color. I'm going to take these ones out only because they're really hard to see in the packaging. And then I got them in gold. Super pretty, right? They're all with the little tubes. So you could use these for leather, to do leather straps, um, bracelets, which I have leather as well. And then here's, and there's two to a pack. And these are silver. It's really hard for the camera to focus on things that are like just blingy and clear. These are like little diamond shapes. So I thought I would try to do something different with those. And of course I'll show the ones when I do a, a tutorial on these. Uh, I'll show this is gunmetal. The ones that you can get at Hobby Lobby. Because I know a lot of you don't have access to downtown LA. But there are any bead that looks like this that has a hole you could use. It's gorgeous. I love that gunmetal color. And then the last one are is a different, it's gold, but you know that gold comes in different shades. So this one is more of a antique. Well, not really antique. It's just a, not a bright gold. How's that? Okay. So these ones are super pretty. And then... You compare the two golds to see the top one is much brighter. So I just picked up all of those colors. Okay, and then I just picked up these, which I always need. And these are those little pouches. So I just got in a cream color and then I got it in this really pretty gray color, and that's it. So this is my bead haul from 
downtown LA. I absolutely, I met up with my amazing friends for our friends miss that um, we normally do, I believe it's January, but um, things just happened, so we did it in March. And um, we had a birthday celebration for my friend Van and Laura, so we combined that into our friend miss and we met at a winery. So anytime we go to downtown LA, um, I I know I go in the morning and Marissa does. Marissa went as well with me and we went in the morning before we met up with everybody else. So I had a blast. So stay tuned. I do have a couple more videos to come and thank you so much for stopping by and I hope you have an amazing and blessed Sunday. I got a lot of videos coming up. Bye.